Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Easter is just a couple of weeks away. I cannot believe it. It came fast this year. If you don't already know, I have two boys, a four-year-old and a seven-year-old. So this is what I put in their Easter baskets this year. We don't have a lot of time till Easter, so let's get going. I am reusing the Easter baskets that I bought last year. I bought these at Target for I think $10 a piece. At the bottom of each basket, I'm going to put some Easter grass. So I'm just gonna pour those into the bottom. And now let's get into the fun part, the toys. I bought them both a Bible sticker and activity book. I got these at Hobby Lobby. These are the story of Easter and it's filled with over 50 stickers. Jesus riding on the donkey, the last meal, uh, Jesus in the garden. And then um, there's the stickers. Can you find the difference? A dot to dot. So they each got one of those. Put them in the baskets. And then for Judah's basket, my seven-year-old, because he is a reader, I got him a little book, The Very First Easter. So this is just the story of Easter with a few more words than that book. So he'll be able to read that. And then for Asher, because he's not a reader, he is four um, and he really likes cars and trucks and stuff. I got him this Melissa and Doug magnetic take along jigsaw puzzles. This has two 15 piece puzzles and they are magnetic so you could take them in the car I and mean, he's been really into puzzles so I feel like you would really like that one. You can't have an Easter basket without some sort of candy. I don't go too crazy on candy number one uh, because Judah my seven year old doesn't like candy and my four year old really likes candy so I try to minimize the amount of candy that he um, intakes. I did go ahead and grab these at Walmart. For Asher, the four-year-old, I got him gummy bears. He really likes gummies. And for Judah, I got him Hershey Kisses because he does like chocolate and he would eat those. So I got him that. And if you know my boys, you know they love the Ninja Turtles. They have loved Ninja Turtles since they were born, just about. This past year, a new movie did come out, which has been fantastic because there's a lot more Ninja Turtles in the stores now than there was just a couple of years ago. I couldn't find anything for them. So it's fun seeing all the Ninja Turtle toys that I can buy them now. At Walmart in the Easter section, they have Ninja Turtle bubble wands. So I got them both a bubble wand. The nicer weather's coming, we're gonna be playing outside and bubbles are always fun to have when you're outside. Asher really loves bath time, he loves bath toys and he's also super into dinosaurs. So at Hobby Lobby, this was in the summer section, not the Easter section, I found this dinosaur bath toy set. It's got one large dinosaur that's holding the three little baby dinosaurs. So whether he decides to use these as bath toys or just to have them to play with, I don't know, but I think he will enjoy that. And then also at Hobby Lobby for Judah, I got this squishy carrot. It's definitely squishy. It's rubbery on the outside, but it feels almost like there's sand on the inside, if you know what I'm talking about, like that kind of squishy. It says you can stretch it, smooth it, roll or pat it. Judah likes weird, squishy, stretchy, things. So I think he'll really like that. Also at Hobby Lobby in the Easter section, they had these egg shaped packages. Inside has what looks like Legos, but are not the Lego brand, but a little Lego kit where you can put together some sort of vehicle. So I got both of the boys, one of those, I got them different ones. I got Asher, a dump truck, and I got Judah, a helicopter. At Walmart, I found exploding bunny poop. That's right, exploding bunny 
poop. It's just the little poppers like you get at the 4th of July. Of course, they rebranded it to be a little Easter-y. I know my kids will get a kick out of the name of that, and also it'll be fun to go outside and throw them around. The only other candy I decided to get for their basket were these little egg M&Ms. Like I said, Judah doesn't really like candy, but he does like just plain chocolate. M&Ms count as just plain chocolate. At least the plain M&Ms do. I found these in the Walmart Easter toy section. What do you call these? These are the Melty Bead Kits. Do you call them Melty Beads? Do they have a specific name? I don't even know. They're both keychains. Asher likes dinosaurs. Judah's into video games, so I got him a Minecraft. These are great for a rainy day when you've got bored kids and you don't have anything else to do. Those are great to pull out and have them do something a little crafty. Like I said, my boys are really into the Ninja Turtles. Asher especially is super obsessed with Ninja Turtles. So I got him a couple of things Ninja Turtle related. I know I already got him a bubble wand, but then I went to Target and I saw this bubble container. How cute is this guy? Leonardo is his favorite Ninja Turtle and Asher loves bubbles. So it's not like you can ever have enough bubbles with little kids. They go through them so fast or they spill them. You always need bubbles on hand. That's why I had to get Asher that. Super cute and bubbles are fun. For Christmas, we we went to Texas to hang out with my parents. My mom bought a bunch of card games that they could play. There were a couple of games that Judah really enjoyed, one of them being War, which I know you can play War with just a regular deck of cards, which we have, but this was kind of like a fun deck of cards and he really enjoyed that. So when I was at Hobby Lobby looking for stuff for the Easter baskets, I found War. I also found Old Sloth, which I think is supposed to be like Old Maid, and then I found crazy eights. So we went ahead and got those at Hobby Lobby. More Ninja Turtles. These I found again at the Walmart Easter toy section. These are Ninja Turtle chalk holders. They do come with chalk, but they are the little holders that hold the chalk in place so that you can write with it easier. Just like the bubbles, you can never have enough chalk for little kids. And we do have a lot of chalk, but we actually don't have any chalk holders like this. So I'm pretty sure Asher will love that. Judah is a fan of all things video games and that includes Mario. I found these Super Mario Bros toys. I got these at Target after Christmas on clearance, which was a super random find because I have seen these in the store full price since then. So I'm not sure why after Christmas they decided to clearance them and then bring them back full price. Stores are weird like that. They do this all the time and I don't get it, but I'm not complaining because I get a clearance price on toys. So I grabbed a few. I actually gave the boys some in their Valentine's Day baskets, which I should really start making a video about that too. I had some left over after that and so I kept them for Judah's Easter basket. So I'm gonna give Judah both of those. For Asher's basket, he loves Play-Doh. Where did I, oh, I got this at Ross. I found Easter egg Play-Doh. It's a set of four containers of Play-Doh in little plastic eggs. So that's what I got for Asher. Disney has this collection of Dorables. And just like the name, they're adorable. They're Disney characters. They've got these big eyes that are are sparkly. They're just so cute. I started getting ads for these Dorables on Instagram, but they're not just any Dorables. They're Star Wars Dorables. And I love Star Wars. I am a sucker for Star Wars. I thought I could put it in Judah's Easter basket because Judah does like Star Wars. He watches Star Wars with us. So I thought he would enjoy it. Plus he does really like opening up blind what do you, this is a circle, it's not a box. What do you call this? Like a blind container, a blind package. I don't know, but he does like opening those. Here's hoping Ahsoka is in this blind box. Please, Ahsoka, be in this blind box. For Asher, his last thing for his Easter basket. Again, I got this at Hobby Lobby. Again, it's Ninja Turtle. We got him a Ninja Turtle kite. I think he would have fun if we go fly a kite. It's something we need to do. We haven't done it in a long time, so maybe having this will help us get out there and fly a kite. Judah's last thing, I got this at Walmart. This is the Dude Perfect Surprise Ball. Shaped kind of like a football, but you could say shaped kind of like an egg. Judah loves Dude Perfect. He watches Dude Perfect with his dad all the time. I think the Dude Perfect guys are great guys. I don't know them personally, obviously, but I think they are good role models for little boys. They do 
fun videos. They are YouTubers, so I am all about supporting their products. This one comes with one surprise character, one inflatable soccer ball, one sticky ball, one never ending spinning top, never ending we'll see about that do perfect one basketball hoop game and six stickers and that is the last thing for Judah's Easter basket so these are the boys' Easter baskets this year I'm excited about them I'm excited to give them to them I love Easter it's one of my favorite holidays not just because of the activities but because of the reason behind the season I am so thankful that Jesus came to this earth and that he chose to die on the cross for my sins, for your sins. And all you have to do is just believe that and accept him and ask him to be Lord of your life. I love getting to go to church, celebrating him rising from the dead. It's just a beautiful, beautiful time to remember those things and to reflect on those things. And I love springtime, flowers blooming everywhere. I love Easter baskets. I love going on Easter egg hunts. It's just a beautiful holiday holiday all around. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope maybe you got some ideas for your Easter baskets. Hurry, Easter is coming up soon. <laughs> you don't have a lot of time left. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.